On our last video, we talked about the first two steps in making a simple presentation in Microsoft Office PowerPoint 2007, the layouts and the design. Next, we're going to talk about how to transform your presentation into a slideshow using animations. Here is where we left off at. We jotted down some stuff in the slide and spliced it up a bit with a new design. This time, we're going to add some animations to it, but before we do so, we need at least one more slide so we can begin talking about animations. On the home tab, click new slide or the arrow next to it, which displays the layouts list, just like what the layouts button does. It makes it so you don't have to change it from its default layout to the new one. In other words, if you click on the actual icon, it'll use the default layout automatically. The default layout is great for beginners, while the arrow next to the icon is best for experienced users and we'll use that layout for our new slide. Now that we have two slides, let's access the animations tab by clicking here. Here are the transitions you can use to start the presentation. You can let it fade in, use circles, or whatever that fits best for you. For this one though, we'll let the presentation fade in, so click here and the transition will take effect. If you'd like a sound to be heard when your presentation starts or ends, use this. We'll do without sound for this one. Anyway, use this setting to determine how fast you want the transition to go. You can let it go slow or let it go fast. Let's allow for the transition to go fast for this one, but you can change this setting at any time here. Sometimes saving the changes in more than one slide can take some time, but you don't have to worry about that. Just click this button and it will apply all your settings in more than one slide. Now you can not only add animations to the slide, but everything that is within the slide, including text and pictures, can all have animations. Just click this button here and it will activate the custom animations task pane located on the right side of the window. To add custom animations to your items, click on the slide item you want to add an animation to. Then click add effect. You can add an entrance, exit, an emphasis, or make your own path and the item will follow it. We'll leave out the animations in this one. Now that we added the animations to go with our extra slide, you can preview it using this button. But in the meantime, that'll do it for this two-part tutorial on how to create a simple presentation using Microsoft Office PowerPoint 2007. We are always making new tutorials, so subscribe to us and visit us on the web at www.inspiredtechnical.com. See you next time.